Okay, the first thing we're going to show you is how to take your Predator programmer for your Hemi and flash a Predator tune onto the vehicle. Okay, after plugging the Predator into the diagnostic port, it'll go through a little boot sequence, take about 15 to 20 seconds. First item on the list is performance tune. We'll go ahead and select that. Gives you a disclaimer that you should read. Once you read it, go ahead and scroll over to the right and then select agree. Now it'll tell us to turn the ignition on. On a push button car, you're going to hit the button twice. Then hit continue with a keyed car. Just turn the key on until right before it starts. Right now we have two options, Diablo tunes and quick adjust. If there was a custom tune loaded, which we'll get to later, it would give you one more option. So right now we'll pick Diablo tune. We'll just go ahead and load the performance uh, CAI 93 octane. We'll go ahead and select choose. Now it's telling us the original backup will be saved. This is the tune that came stock on the vehicle. It's going to be sucked off of it and put onto the Predator in case you ever want to go back to stock. Okay, right now it's pulling the stock tune off. This takes uh, quite, a, quite a bit of time, so we'll go ahead and fast forward. Uh, once it's done pulling the stock tune off, it'll go through a process where it checks to make sure it pulled it off correctly. It's just finishing that up right now. Okay, at this point the original backup's been saved. For those of you doing a custom tune and not interested in loading the Predator stock tunes, you can stop at this point and unplug the Predator. For those of you loading the default tunes, um, you can keep going. So we'll keep going with the video. Uh, the next thing we'll do is click install tune. Okay, at this point, it's going to load the tune on. This is a lot quicker than sucking the stock tune off. Okay, it tells you to turn the key off and then back on. So we'll hit it once to turn it off. And then twice to turn it back on. Then it tells you the name of the tune and that it is installed in the vehicle. And you can unplug it and you're done. So we'll unplug it now and go uh, walk you through taking the stock tune off to send us for a custom tune. First thing you're going to need is the DS Downloader, which you can get off the Diablo Sport website at diablosport.com. Okay, uh, you can go right to Support and then to Downloads. And then you're going to select Predator 7135. Scroll down, and here at the bottom, near the bottom, you've got DS Downloader. Click on that. You can either save it to your desktop or just run it right from there. We'll save it to the desktop.
Okay, we'll go back to the desktop now. And DS Downloader's right here. We'll go ahead and get that installed. The next thing we'll do is install the drivers for the USB to serial converter. Put the CD in that came with the cable. You want the USB to serial cable, Windows, install, and then that will install the drivers. And that's it. Now we should be able to plug the Predator in. Launch DS Downloader. Select 7135. You'll see down here it's trying to connect the Predator, it will check different COM ports. It just found the tool on COM5. The first thing we'll do is get tune file from tool. It asks you if you want to download the original backup. To do that, click yes. At this point, you'll see the screen of the Predator doing a uh, doing something, it's getting the tune ready to download. Okay, then it'll pop up and ask you where you want to save it. You can always put it in My Documents. It will pop up, this is the calibration code for your vehicle. You can leave that in there, but you might want to put your last name in there. Just so we know whose it is. So I'll just put Jones dash and then the calibration code, and then you click save. Then to email it, all you need to do is open up your email program, email it to sales at modulardepot.com, stock tune file for Jones. Click Attachments, you go to your, your Documents, that is the file we downloaded. Click Send, and we're all done. Next thing we're going to go over is how to put the custom tune that we email you onto the Predator. Here's the email that uh, you would receive, and here's the tune file. You can right click on that, save it, we'll save it to the My Documents folder. Uh, we'll go ahead and power up the Predator with the power cable and plug that into the USB port. Open DS Downloader. Make sure it says 7135. Okay. Once the uh, software finds the Predator, this screen will pop up. We'll click Send Tune File. We want to select the custom tune. Here it will tell you you can either choose the last saved file or browse for the original backup. We'll go ahead and just browse for it. Here's the backup we saved earlier. That's it. Now, uh, when you went to load the tune before, where it said uh, Diablo Tunes, there'll be a new screen that says Custom Tunes. You select that, follow all the directions, and you're good to go.